Now I've made a divot in the middle of the fairway. I want to do a couple things to fix this divot. First, I want to kick in the corners, the raised portion of the divot. Next, I want to get the sand or seed bottle from the cart and fill it in with sand so that it's above the level of the surface of the ground. Next, I want to step on it so that it's level or flush with the ground, or just slightly above flush with the ground. Ball marks on the green. To correctly repair a ball mark on the green, you can use a ball mark tool or a tee. You cannot use your putter. You want to insert the tee or the ball mark tool into the raised area adjacent to the hole. You do not want to insert the tool into the middle of the hole. And you want to move the grass over the area of the depression which leaves no soil exposed. We do not want to lift the center portion of the ball mark exposing the soil and then tap it down so the soil sits on top. My own two personal rules for fixing ball marks is when I'm finished it shouldn't look like anyone's been there and I should have no problem putting over that ball mark repair myself. Leaving the golf course in better shape than you found it is a very important aspect for everybody. So when you take a divot, fix two. When you take a ball mark, fix two.